Hey babes, welcome back to my channel. So today is my official first off day. I'm off the next four days. So, oh, and by the way, my birthday is in two days, New Year's, baby. So today is my official first off day. I'm about to get up, get ready. I'm just, I just got in my bathroom, so I'm for the brush my teeth, wash my face, do the whole shit, bang bang. You know what I'm saying? Get ready. Um, today I'm going to be getting my nails done. Um, I want to go to Five Below. And I want to go to Bath and Body Works because, as you guys know, it's that set my annual sale that have it every, I think, June and December of every year. So, it's that time again. So, I feel like I'll see. Honestly, I don't really need anything, to be honest. But, I'm really going for the candles. And they and they brought back the brown sugar and fig. If y'all know, y'all know. That's an OG. That's an original. So, I got like two sprays, two body um, lotions, and the cream. So, I'm stuck on that. I don't need anybody care. I just want to go get their candles. Like, they're 75% off candles. That's my goal for Back to Body Works today. So, yeah, Back to Body Works. I want to go to Five Below and get my nails done. And then come back home and just chill. Like, I don't want to do too much on my first off day. But, yeah, so I'm about to get ready. And I'm going to see you guys once I'm dressed. So, I can show you the fit of the day. And then we're going to head out. So this is the OTD, it's the outfit of the day. Shoes, I think from Ross, or DD is one of them. Purse from Burlington, Steve Madden purse. Watch band from Amazon. Shirt, Ross. Jacket, little thingy, Walmart shorts. Um, I wanna say Burlington, it's been a while since I bought any of this stuff, but yeah, this is the outfit of the day. Don't mind my messy floor. I gotta clean my room. And the scent of the day, I am using the Juicy Couture perfume. I also have the lotion that match it. That's just one of many of my collections. But yeah, this is the scent of the day. And I'm about to go ahead out. So the first stop will be at five below and I'll see y'all there. Dunkin Donuts. So I just pulled up to Dunkin Donuts. I seen online and on the app that they have this um, cookie butter, um, I think iced coffee that I've been hearing some good things about. So I decided to come here today because I didn't really have my coffee this morning. So I decided to come to Dunkin Donuts. I was out anyway, but everyone knows who knows me, I have to get my coffee. So I'm about to pull up and get this uh, coffee and something to eat because I have not had breakfast this morning. Hello, okay. Hello, can I get your um, wake up wrap sandwich with bacon, please? Which one? The wake up wrap sandwich. I'm so hungry. Can I get the uh, wake up wrap sandwich, please? The sausage and cheese? No, with bacon. Okay. Anything else? Yes, and can I also try their small cookie butter um, iced coffee? Small iced cookie butter? Yeah. Okay. Um, I think yes, with cream, please. Hold up. About to pull up and get my breakfast and coffee. I'm starving. Like. Seriously, I'm so freaking hungry. Thank you so much. Got my breakfast and my coffee. <laughs> it's funny because this um, Dunkin' Donuts used to be a freaking car wash. <laughs> Oh, yeah, my purse is all over the place. But this Dunkin' Donuts used to be a car wash. And I think I came here before and got my car washed. But yeah, they have the best breakfast. Like, I'm not gonna lie, y'all. 
I've been sleep on freaking Dunkin' Donuts, like breakfast. I've always been a fan of that coffee, but that breakfast, mm, mm -mm. I don't know. I just, is that a problem or something? Or what? Shit, motherfucker. I'm sorry, y'all. People just be trying me. People be trying me. This stupid ass thought, thought I wasn't going to turn. But no, I'm finna turn. You gonna sit there and wait until I'm ready to move. I got the right away. Anyway, so I'm, I'm about to pull up to the Steenies and see if, if I can find me some new scrubs for work because I need some new scrubs for work. And I, I wish you would. You got a problem? Anyway, yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this perfect and I'm gonna see how once I get to the Steenies. So, yeah. Just arrived at Didi's for to go see what I can find here. Lord knows I'm coming here only for scrubs for work. But you know, I always come out with things that I don't even need. But yeah, let go. So y'all yeah, already know, whenever I come to a store, the first section that I run to is the purses. So if not purses, it's the feminine hygiene section. But let me show y'all a few purses that they got. They have this cute brown purse. Yeah, I don't think I have a purse this color. This is cute. But guys, we're not rich, so we gonna check these price tags. 17 bucks, not bad at all. The red purse is ugly. They have this purple purse down here. They also have another purse, but in like the burgundy color. This one is a dollar cheaper. Don't know why, but what else do they have? They have this cute little purse right here. It's kind of cute. I'm not really seeing much. And they have another purse that is red. And this one is 16 bucks too. I have enough red purses to be honest. And of course, this is their feminine section right here. They have the OG Original Cucumber Dove. They have this one I've never used before. I don't know, I might pick this up to be honest. I've never used that one before. And then they have the pistachio, which I have in my shower right now. They also, is this the same one, the Zuzu Fresh? No, that's a different one. They also have the Daily Silk one. This area is so disgusting. Um, they also have this peach one I've never used before either. What else do they have? Some other ones, Spanish. <laughs> they have a lot of Nivea's too. Let's just smell these. Then they have tons of the Beauty Bar, the original Dove, the Shea Butter one, some Epsom socks. Let's just go around and see what else we can find. I did pick up this. Dove micellar water. I've never seen this one before. Never, so that's a gem. So I feel like this area could be a little more organized, but I guess. You guys, they have tons of um, lotions over here for $3.99. The Aveeno. Oh, this is body wash. For eczema, I might pick this up. Like, I might go ahead and get that. But yeah, they have the Vaseline Cocoa Radiant for $2.99, not bad. They have the St. Ives for $2.99, not bad at all. They also have the big one for 4 bucks. Guys, these are still, and then they have the raw shea butter for $3.99, so good. So I found two more of their lotions. This is the St. Eyes Renewing Collagen Body Lotion. And this is the Essential Healing one for $3. And this is $3. Such. I'm finding some great things, guys. They have Olay. They have the Pink Dove, the Rose one. And what is this? Vaseline has, what? Bar soap? Oh my God, that is such amazing. What else can I find here? Other than that, I'm seeing if they have another Vaseline one right here as well.
hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is LaPortia if you guys are a return subscriber thank you for clicking on this video I got some things that you guys want to see and if you're not a subscriber go ahead and click that subscribe button if you do not know I like to post girly videos hair makeup skincare purses anything girly that's me so this video is not gonna be that long because um, I really didn't need that much stuff so and I did this over my birthday weekend my birthday was on New Year's so I just wanted to get out just to get a few things that I did need, some things that of course I didn't need, but that's neither here nor there. So let's just jump to the video. So the first store I went to was Pop Shelf. This store is new. A lot of states still don't have this store. I think I heard about this store a few months ago when I was watching, I forgot who channel it was, but she said Pop Shelf and when she went inside, it looks very, very, very clean, organized. It's like a store that I could see myself shopping at. So I was driving out and about story time. So I was just driving out and about and I saw the store pop shelf. You could say it was new because they had like a little banner. The store wasn't even open yet. But I pulled up and it said about 10 o'clock you'll be open. So I'm just driving around waiting. So it opens and I pulls up and I go inside and I got some little goodies. You know, nothing too exciting really. Um, I got some of these bamboo stick uh, cotton swabs. I've already been using them because, again, I needed these. So, um, and this this store is more like a, not organic, but like more like a save the earth, go green type store. But they have things in there that's not, of course, go green. But these things work so good. They're so comfortable. And they're, it's a 300 count for only a dollar. This store is very inexpensive. You can find like a lot of name brands from like the brand Hello, um, Method, they have Game Top, they have a bunch of great name brands for the Lolo. Again, this is only a dollar with 500 cotton swabs in it. I'm sorry, 300 cotton swabs. It was a no brainer. And then I also picked up these I've never seen before at any store. This is the Garbage Disposal Refresher and Cleaner Pods. Again, this is a uh, grab green, more like a, a gold green type of um, little cleaning product. And this one has 12 pods in it. It's in the scent tangerine living grass. Nothing really to talk about. You just put them in your garbage disposer, you run it, you clean it. Then the last thing that I got, again, I didn't get that much stuff because I didn't need that much. And I also found by the brand Simple, this is a great brand, by the brand Simple, they have pure soap for sensitive skin. I might be late to the game, but Simple have bar soaps. I never knew that. And it was only $2, it says it right here, a dollar bar, still a great deal. So I mean, you know what, let me go ahead and try this. And, and, and again, this is for sensitive skin. I have sensitive skin. It has no perfumes, no dyes in it. So anything sensitive, I'm going to put on my skin because my skin breaks out very easy. I have dark spots that I'm trying to get rid of. So I, I don't need anything messing up my skin so far. But yeah, I did pick up this Simple Bar Soaps. And that was the last thing from Pop Shelf. You guys, if y'all have a Pop Shelf, go check them out. Like, this is a really gritty. I'm sorry, I just cars passing by. I'm by a busy street, so y'all might see cars passing in the background. But anyway, this store has some great things that I think you guys will really, really enjoy. So if, you, if you're passing by, you see one or you live by one, Go ahead and check them out. And I also went to Five Below. Um, I really couldn't record in Five Below because for one, it was too quiet in there. And then for two, this man kept staring at me. And honestly, I feel uncomfortable. If, I, if, if I'm uncomfortable, I'm not gonna film or be somewhere where I'm not uncomfortable. I, I'm just not gonna do it. So I did get this um, bag of Five Below. I got some items in here. So let me go ahead and show y'all. So I did see this cute little black leggings. I mean, black pretty much goes with everything for only $5 in the size large. Again, I don't know if they're, if they're close, sometimes run too big or too small, but sometimes their smalls are like a large, but 
I did get these tights right here. I thought these were cute and comfortable. I mean, this camera doesn't know justice, but the material is so soft. It had like stripes in it. Something that I can wear around the house or to run to the store or something, you know, really, really quick. Again, I got it in black. Black goes with everything. I also picked up these black, I'm black, these gray joggers. Again, this was five bucks in the size large as well. You know, your girl is on the thicker side. So I did pick up these gray joggers. Again, they look so soft, comfortable. So my ass, I thought that I got a set. Me not paying attention, I'm probably me rushing. I picked up this gray, right? Oh, it's a cute two piece. Got home, start going through the bag. These are like two different grays, y'all. This is way lighter and this is like way darker. So I'm like, oh, you girl find a two piece. Like honestly, Five Below has some great two pieces for the low low. Like, I get a lot of my two pieces from Five Below. I told my boyfriend, I was like, oh, I got this two piece. And then that's why I showed him. And I'm like, hold up, this is not the same gray. But, you know, it's cute. I can find something else to wear with, you know, black bottoms, gray bottoms, whatever. It's very, very stretchy. I, and I got this in the size medium. Again, this medium was like a large. Look how big this medium is. So, again, I'm going to just wear this like around the house, something comfortable, chill vibes, Netflix type chill. You know what I'm saying? So, I did get that shirt, and then I did get these bottoms. Then I also got... Again, me not paying attention. I got these rings that I thought were so, so freaking cute. They have one in green. Then I have it in the clear. And this is how it looks. Super cute, super aesthetic. I like the way it looks. And so, story time again. So this bottom right here is supposed to have another ring. I didn't even notice. If I would have known, I would have asked for like a discount, but your girl missing a whole ring right there. How I found out was, at the time I, I didn't know. So I purchased these and then I went back the next day to see if I could find the shirt for the, for the pants. Couldn't find it. So I started browsing in the jewelry section and they had more of these, but with the third ring on it. And I'm like, hold up. If I would have known that, I would have just asked for a discount. But you know, I want shipping, and this was only four twenty five. I don't know if I can see it, but four twenty five, right here at the bottom. But anyway, I went tripping. This is what it is. Still cute. I'm still gonna wear them. So that's that. Then I also got these um, rings. These were how much were these? Honestly, I think about four dollars as well. And again, I got these gold rings. If you guys know me, I'm into the evil eye. I'm pretty sure that's not what it's called, but that's what I call it. And I'm going to, I don't know what this is called, like with the hand. If y'all let me know, let me know in the comments what that hand is called right there. This little hand right here. And also I know they have the evil eye right here. And they have another evil eye somewhere on here. Oh, right here. This ring right here. All the evil eyes on it. But yeah, this is super cute, super dope for about $4. And I got... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rings for about four dollars. And they all have well, most of them have like cute designs on them. Super cute. And then I love gold. Like if you guys know me, I love gold. I prefer gold and jewelry, but if it's still cute, I'm gonna get it regardless. But I did get those rings that I'm dying to wear. I cannot wait. I don't get out much, so I'm like, when it's time to get out, I'm gonna pull out the best of the best. So I also got this, um, this is by the brand LA Colors, the Ultimate Cover Concealer. And this is in the shade Espresso, right here. That's what it says, Espresso on the side. And me, I do do makeup, but I also wanna learn how to do it a little bit better than the way I do. Um, I wanna learn how to like contour, contour my makeup, is that how you say? Contour my makeup. So I thought, you know, I'm gonna start off with this dark, dark concealer. I know you put it like around whatever, but you know, I've been YouTube with everything, so I'm going to find out on YouTube how to contour your makeup a little bit better than the way I do. So I know they have different shades of concealer, of course. So I picked up this one. I'm going to probably do, do like a little makeup tutorial. I don't know. I'm still thinking about it because your girl is still learning how to do her makeup. But when I do do it, it be bomb. 
Don't come for me. Don't be like, oh, she don't, she don't, because I know what I'm doing. I'm not a professional, but I know what I'm doing. But yeah, I did pick up this one, and I think this was about, I want to say $5 too. So yeah, I cannot wait to try out all these new things, my new accessories, and my little loungewear. I cannot wait. But that was it for Five Below. Again, I didn't get much. Didn't need much. Now, I did go to DD's discount. I love BDs. Yeah, I'm cheap sometimes. I don't really care. I'm cheap for certain things. That's the point. You have to know how to shop. Like, if I can find some cheaper somewhere, I'm going to go where it's cheaper. Like, that's just what it is. Like, if I can save a coin, I'm going to save a coin. But, yeah, I did find these two um, Vaseline packs of bar soaps. Again, I probably late to the game. But Vaseline have bar soaps. Like, I never knew that. They're known for, like, their Vaseline, their lotions. But I've never seen bar soaps. And this one is in... It says Vaseline Jelly. This is the Total Moisture Soy Protein and Oak Extract. So I'm guessing this is to like give your skin a moisture. And this is a two pack, no, a three pack for only $3. So basically a bar, a dollar a bar. So I did get that one. And then I got this pink one. This is um, the Healthy Bright with Vitamin B3. I'm guessing this is supposed to help like brighten your skin, maybe dark spots, or just to get like certain areas lighter on, on your face. Again, $2.99 for three bars. This was a steal. You know, they should have like these in the shade on a bar. Like that would be so amazing. Hint, hint, Vaseline, hint, hint, go ahead. This is not what's the, sponsored by Vaseline, but if you get one to sponsor your girl for Vaseline, go ahead. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, yeah. And then I also got this Dove Sensitive Skin Micellar Bar Soap. Did not know Dove had micellar bar soap. Never knew that. Or the body wash. I never knew that. So, and this was $2.99 for two bars. Again, not bad. This is a hypoallergenic beauty bar with micellar technology. Again, this is for my face only. All of these bar soaps are going on my face. They're all Vaseline sensitive skin micellar water like i put all of that on my skin so if, if you guys see these like pass them i'm not pass them up don't pass them up because because when you go back oh, i get it next time it's not going to be there when it's a deal it's a deal get it <laughs> and then i also got this little cute shirt i mean i live in texas but the weather has been off and on it's been cold it's been hot it's been cold it's been hot it's been raining it's been sunny whatever foggy but this is like a long sleeve cute little shirt that i got and this was 7.99 and this is in the size large i get everything basically large or if or if it's a medium but it runs big i'm gonna get a medium but i thought this was super cute I'm not sure what bottoms I can wear with this. I'm pretty sure some jeans or like some black, some black leggings, some black um, leather pants. I don't know y'all, but I don't, I'm going to put something together with this. This is like super, super cute and I love it. You know, sometimes less is more. Sometimes you don't have to be doing the most to make an outfit pop and look good. So I did get that. And then the last thing that I got from Dee Dee's was this. Um, I don't know, like, if it's, I mean, I, I know it's plaid, but it's like, is it a cardigan? Is it, like, I forgot what they call it, but if you guys know, comment down below, what is this type of shirt called? Flannel. I think it's a flannel. I think that's what it is. Flannel. Correct me if I'm wrong. But, yeah, this is, uh, this was $9.99, a good, good deal. This was in the size medium. As you guys can see right here. And this is by the brand No Comments. I've never heard of them, but this shirt is super dope, super cute. I can wear this with, with some jeans, some black leggings again. Like, I, I'm going to put something together. Like, it's not hard for you girls to put an outfit together. It's just super cute. You know, I would try this on for you guys, but I don't have the energy, to be honest with you. But this is super cute. I'm going to put some outfits together. You know what I'm going to do? I want to do a clothing haul for y'all. I've never done a clothing haul. Clothing haul slash try on haul for y'all. I've never done anything like that. So yeah, maybe I'll do that. Let me know in the comments if y'all want to see something like that. But 
again that was everything that i got from those stores that i went to again nothing too too major nothing too over the top just some basic things that i needed and wanted it to be honest so if you guys like this video go ahead comment subscribe um let me know what you guys want to see i'm into all kind of things honestly i'm an open book so just let me know in the comments throw some ideas at me again like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next video